A slowly sinking neighborhood in North Las Vegas. For decades, they've been waiting for help to get out of their failing homes. Now, residents are speaking out against an idea from the governor's office that would redirect federal money meant to rebuild their sinking homes. Fox 5's Kim Passoff has been following this story for years for us. She joins us now at the latest. Kim? Yeah, so we have been through the neighborhood into the homes. Some of the original residents from the 60s still live there. They have cracks in their walls and in their foundations as groundwater was sucked out from beneath them long ago, causing their homes to shift and sink. We matter. We deserve to be have new homes. The streets and sidewalks. Horrible. Horrible. The house is actually shifted to the left. My home insurance, they canceled on me. God, please don't have this house fall on us and kill us. Resident after resident of Windsor Park sharing their stories before an interim finance committee, how they feel unsafe in their own sinking homes. The neighborhood showing up to present a united front and express their anger with a proposal from Governor Lombardo. The governor gave us the money, now he wants 25 million of it back to build low income homes for someone else. The governor wants the state legislature to look into changing the funding streams to build new homes near the failing neighborhood. Governor Lombardo signed a bill last year that set aside $37 million to build about 90 new homes nearby. But some of that money comes from the federal government and expires in December 2026 if the homes aren't built by then. The governor wants $25 million in federal funds replaced with money from the state general fund, money that doesn't come with an expiration. But with the build of new homes on track for the first time in decades, these residents are opposed to funding changes. The contractor is ready to build. And it seems like every time we move forward, we end up going backwards. I do not want my children to grow up having to fight this fight. I'm tired. I just, I want this resolved. And the governor's office tells Fox 5, quote, the proposal to change funding streams for the project secures funding for Windsor Park. Instead of leaving it susceptible, this proposal guarantees the future of Windsor Park community and any attempts to portray it otherwise are political and disingenuous. And today's committee meeting was informational only for lawmakers, a chance to get an update on the progress of Windsor Park. It's unclear if the legislature will take up the funding issue during next year's legislative session.